I promise to help you, but you must eat. Mm. Whether you do what, you're going to come and eat this food. Chilave. Hello, Anita. What? Come and look for the file yourself. I told you that I'm going to number to the chief. I'm going to get a network. Will you come and look for the file over? Ha. Need to be on far. But but tell me what document you're looking for. <clears throat> Who are you talking to? Um, uh, I was... Anita, there's a reason why I told you not to call her. I'm the file of him, Buzi. Be the key. Found a cop in my office. <sighs> Sanyo, what are you doing here? I had to come. Why did you do it? What did I do at Sanyu? Sanyu, I'm innocent. You know that. Sorry about that. It's OK. It doesn't matter. All I need is someone to believe in me, Sanyu. But I swear, I... Sanyu, I did kill George. Oscar, I don't know that. How do you expect me to believe you? Sanyu, you have to believe me. I told them everything. Sanyu, when I got there, all I saw was a a dead, burnt body, and then the police came in later, and they said that I killed him? Gentlemen, lady, how may I be of help? So we, we are from Butavika Hospital. We have been told there is a mental patient here that needs admission at Butavika. I don't understand. Uh, someone from the Chirunda family called us. Oh, there must be a misunderstanding, because my mother is perfectly fine. Lucy, hmm? did you call Butabika Hospital to come for my mother because she is sick? She's not just sick, she's losing it. She needs help. Where is she? How is the condition? Can we see her? My mother is perfectly fine. Please be on your way. Sir, every patient has a right to a doctor, whether you feel ashamed or not. She's been attended to by the most trusted personal doctor. And he said she is fine. Please, take your leave. Here. Uh, can that wait? I need to talk to you. What is it? You remember those apartments in Indeje? Yeah, the ones where that snake pish used to stay? Yeah, right. <laughs> I told the tenants to move out. What's that got to do with anything? I need you to move in there. Why would I move in there? Well, because you're an expectant mother and clearly you need more space. That's not that full of you, Patrick. So. When do we move out? Not us. You. What do you mean, me?